Hey, what is going on guys? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Adrian here bringing you guys another video and this is going to be a what sold video um, over on eBay. I sold about I think a little over 20 items in the past five days. So that's pretty good. Um, I think I made about over $680 in sales. And um, yeah, so I'm going to be showing you guys what I sold from June 28th through the weekend all the way until today, July 2nd. And the day's technically not over yet, so hopefully uh, maybe a sell or two maybe will pop in. Usually does. But if not, I'm going to be showing you guys what sold for me. Hope you guys like this like this video. If you guys do, I'll do more of them. Um, you know, I'll throw them in to my schedule. So I'm going to be showing you guys what sold. So the first item you see on the screen is a Harley Davidson of Sacramento uh, men's shirt size extra large this thing has been sitting for me for like two or three maybe like three months maybe four months and I just lowered the price someone offered me seven dollars I took it so got rid of that <laughs> this was a RJC this next one you see is a RJC men's um, button-up shirt this was a size medium I almost kept it for myself but I sold it, it was brand new with tags I sold it for $22 pretty good sell there this one is a Mattel Fisher Price Rescue Heroes action figures. A lot of 14. I think I picked these up at a yard sale a while back. Sold for 40 bucks on a best offer. I think I had them up for like 45. And someone offered me 40, so I just took it. This was actually a really good sell. This is that you see now. It's a vintage Nissan. It was a corduroy, like trucker snapback. It was corduroy, really nice red. I got it for 50 cents at a um, some thrift store. Sometimes they have a 50 cent uh, hat rack or bin and I found this one in there and put it up for $33 or $32.88 free shipping and it sold. So a really good sale there. These ones I picked up on half off day at Salvation Army, these boots right here. Never heard of the brand but I looked them up and they were going for around $35 to $45 upwards to $60. Um, these ones were pretty nice. Uh, I guess the brand is called Nokana leather exotic lizard cowboy boots i picked these up uh, they were six dollars got them half off so three dollars at the salvation army and i sold them for 40 bucks shipped this was a kenneth cole reaction 3.4 ounce cologne cologne actually does pretty well um I, I don't really sell cologne but this one honestly i had laid around my house i just it's been um in my cabinet for like a long time in my bathroom and it's brand new i used it maybe a couple times but Personally, the the smell gives me a headache. I, I'm pretty sensitive to smells, and um, you know, it was like probably I, it was like nine out of ten filled, and it sold for fifteen bucks. So, you know, pretty good there. This one, um, if you saw my Instagram story a couple like last week, I picked up this Javinci bag, uh, traveler bag, weekender bag, um, and it sold for forty four dollars. I think I paid like eight bucks for it, and it shipped about twelve eighty in a medium flat rate. This is a jersey that I've been having that I had, you know, laying around. It's a Kobe Bryant, Los Angeles Lakers kids jersey sold for 14 bucks. This is a men's Pendleton Western Rancher shirt. The, um, the West, the, like the Rancher shirts are like just the plain, um, like plaid Pendleton button ups don't do too well. Like if you can get like the, the wool ones, like long sleeve, the nice ones, those sell very well and very fast. I've sold those upwards 50, 60 bucks. But, you know, the button-up shirts do okay, but this one's been sitting for a couple months. Uh, I think I paid, you know, five bucks for it, so it sold for 20 so not too bad. These were the Doc Martens. Um, I lowered the price on them. Someone offered me 55 and I just took them. I think I paid like $8, so I made good profit on them. And, yeah, so this next one's a vintage, it was a 90s red Nike Snapback. I think it had it up there for like 18 bucks, 20 bucks or something. Someone offered me 15 so I took it. This one is a pretty good brand to look out for, guys. Um, it sells very fast. I listed this for, I think, $23. I got it for like, um, I think it was $1.50 or $2 at Salvation Army on half off day. And it sold next day. Someone sent me an offer at 20 bucks. I took it. Next item you see here is a vintage Yosemite National Park single stitch shirt. I think I had it up for maybe 14 bucks, maybe, or maybe not exactly sure but I took it a best offer of $11 so pretty decent sell not the best here's another good brand to look out for um, especially boots they do very well these are some Harley Davidson men's riding boots work boots leather black leather sold for 53 bucks next item you see are 
Living Dead Dolls. Um, very good. Uh, if you find these, they're pretty rare. These took a while to sell. I've had these for probably about two months, maybe almost three months, and they sold for 70 bucks and 12.80 to ship. So I made a pretty good profit on that. This is an Xbox that I picked up at a Goodwill for I think ten dollars. Uh, it was like 9.89. Worked perfectly fine. Threw a game in there. Um, sold it for 48 dollars shipped. I think it cost about eight, about 17, about 18 dollars to ship. That nine dollar cost fees. I made about 20. 20 ish dollars on that these are some ed hardy uh koi fish um, board shorts sold those for 13.50 they haven't paid yet but sold those here's the next one um this sold for 60 dollars. it was brand new it was a ipong table trainer robot i guess you set it up on a ping pong table and um it, it, you know somebody it hits it back it like shoots the balls out for you and you could you know practice with it and that sold for 60 bucks, full asking price. Here's, uh, if you guys see my story on Instagram, I picked these up. These are really good to look out for. Um, they're called the Five, five Fingers Shoes. Um, really good. Let me click up on them so you guys can see. And, yeah, so that's what they look like, you know, little Five Finger Shoes. These do very well. I think I had these up for, I think, 40 I think 43 someone offered me 35 bucks I paid like five bucks for them so I took it coming back coming down to the end guys last two items um, this is a vintage Marvel Ghost Rider doll action figure I sold it for 18 bucks I think I paid like two bucks not too bad and the last one these are some Crocs Jackson Pollock studio men's um, I saw one listing up um, I priced these a little low really low actually I think I had them at like 65 or 55 or something like that I think it was 55 someone offered me 45 bucks took about a week to a week to sell and I paid three dollars for them on half off day at Salvation Army sold for $45 so pretty good sales so yeah guys that is what sold for me from um, the 28th till today July 20 or July 2nd hope you guys enjoyed the video a little bit of a longer video about seven minutes and 30 seconds we're about to be at um, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you guys for watching. If you guys do, let me know what you guys think about it in the comments and if you guys want me to do more. Um, I am going to be vlogging a little more. Um, so you guys are going to be seeing vlogs. Um, hopefully what sold if you guys like these. More hauls. Um, kind of just a little bit of everything, switching it up. And yeah, hope you guys enjoy the content and thank you guys for sticking around. Um, yeah, peace out guys. Have a good day.